Let's take a look here at service principles for Azure AD, and this is a security identity used by applications or services to access specific Azure resources. So a service principle is created when a user from the tenant has consented to the applications or API use. And so uh, what you do is you'd go over to app registrations uh, to uh, be able to set up a service principle. So this defines who can access the application and what resources the application can access. So down below, you can see we have a few different options here. Um, so whether it's uh, the organizational directory uh, from the current company or a different one, or whether you're allowed to use a personal account. So a service principle is created in each tenant where the application is used and references the global unique application object. So after you've registered your application, you're going to have an object ID and an application ID. That's what I was talking about earlier when I said about application registration, we come back to it. Well, this is the part where we're seeing how that works. So the application ID represents the global applications across Across all tenants, and the object ID is a unique value for an application object. So there you go.